Welcome back to a new video. Today it's all about the new Volkswagen Multimedia System Android Auto demonstration. I will try to connect my phone. Actually, I will connect my phone uh, to the Android Auto on the new Volkswagen Multimedia System. Why I said it's the Volkswagen new Multimedia System? Because the Volkswagen use this Multimedia System not only on one model and they use it on many models. So you can see how you can connect your phone to the Android Auto. And right now we are in the new uh, Volkswagen Caddy. It doesn't matter the model of the car because the Multimedia System is the same. So you should do uh, the same things. So now let me take out the phone actually first of all you will need to start the car or actually put the contact to the car uh, then you have to start your phone then you have to go to the home here just like that press the home button and then you will go to app connection you can see right here press the app connection and here you will be in the app connection then you will go to your phone glow go in the bluetooth press the Bluetooth and then you can see right here it should show you the car name actually this here it's Volkswagen 601 press it one time while you're pressing it you will see a message on your phone and also on your screen you will say uh, the phone will connect to the car then you have to press OK you press yes here then you will see another message android auto and then use android auto okay connect to android auto all right then on the phone you will have another message connecting to android auto you will say connecting to android auto galaxy then on your phone it will say to press a few accept accept i already connected one time and that's why it didn't ask me again but you will have to press accept accept and then you're connected right now you can see it's connected to uh to the calls to the bluetooth to everything so your phone is connected you don't need you can see there in the corner a uh, small steering wheel so that means you connect it and then you have to close the phone it doesn't matter it's work wireless you don't need any cable that's great uh yeah the google map when it say this error need to be a location so you have to turn on the location on your phone in order to work that so let me um, let me turn on the location so you turn on the location right here you can see right now also the wireless have to be on by the way keep in mind and now it's working so you close the phone it doesn't matter you don't have to use it anymore you can leave it down here somewhere also you can charge your phone here wireless that's that's quite awesome you have to put it down there it's, it's really interesting uh, on the caddy if you want to see by the way the, the review with the new Volkswagen caddy check it out on my channel I have it right there test drive review all now let me show you how it looks the Android Auto on this uh, Volkswagen screen so you can see uh, here you still have left those controllers for the normal multimedia system uh, where you have the climatic system if you press it it will get you directly to the climatic system when you can turn it on and off from here pretty simple uh, also you have the controls here and the information about the notification and all kind of stuff up here from the car and here all over the screen right here guys you can see it you can see you have full 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 all the android auto it's all over the screen right there and you have uh, the Google uh, map right now in this moment. I don't know why it's show me it's a night. Maybe because of the phone. Let me take it out. I'm not sure why it say it's a night time and why the map is in the night time. But anyway, it doesn't matter. Normally it looks uh, brighter. I'm not sure if you can change it from here. Settings, root, root settings, settings yeah i don't think so i'm not sure why it show me like that if you go to satellite you will see the satellite mode you have the option to see the satellite mode as well so that's that's quite cool so look at this you can see 3d map from the satellite you can see the stadium you can see everything here it's it's quite cool the same as you see it on your phone you can set a destination and it works simply the same as uh, it will work um, on your phone so satellite turn it off traffic you can see the traffic guidance auto root guidance about and yeah close this another cool part 
on the Google is that you can press this one here and you can use the voice command. Navigate to Barcelona. Navigating to Barcelona. So, how cool is that? In just a few seconds. History crosses through France. Verify COVID-19 border restrictions before going. Quite nice, huh? Guys, how many times? It's, it's the same system. It's really, really uh, insanely good system. Now, um, I'm curious if I can change this brightness of the map, you know? You cannot use it here. I'm not sure why it's showing me that it's uh, dark outside even if i change the lights it's it stay the same dark but usually you should have that brighter screen this is kind of the night time here but anyway um, also you can ask google for many things for example how many degrees are outside the current temperature in Bern is 12 degrees wow quite nice Okay, guys, now you have also the possibility to use here. Wait a second, I just touch. Uh, if you press this button, here's the main, the main, main button here. For example, you press this, you go to the menu. In the menu, you have all the, the application here. Spotify, Maps, uh, Reminder, Weather, and all the application that you have it also on the phone. You can use the Spotify and listen music here, super simple. Uh, just like that then you have all those music that you already uh, hear or uh, the list in the Spotify so it's it's quite quite awesome to be honest uh, to be able to use all that so it's simple as that you can connect one time the phone and then you have it already there uh, if you press this one here it will get you to the menu and now on the menu you will not see here uh, app connection you will see directly android auto and then when you press it it gets you directly to the android auto to the connectivity with your phone as well you see the temperature you see that the connection to the internet and all other stuff like that Guys, that was the video. I hope it was helpful. If you have question, ask me anything you want. I will answer uh, to all your question. Um, also, don't forget to subscribe to the channel if you want to see the latest uh, car and news and information from auto industry. Uh, like it, share it. That would mean a lot for me. Uh, and I hope it was helpful. See you soon in the next one. Bye, guys.